welcome back to it's beyond g where we vlog a family food and travel tv if this is your first time here welcome and if you're returning hey family it is vlogmas ish day nine happy saturday right thank you all for tuning in to our vlogs i've been appreciating you your support your comments it means so so much to me and my family we had a blast last night at winterfest lots of ice skating lights parades the music everything was just perfect it was a nice evening the weather it was like 50 something i think when we got back to the car it was like 41 42 i don't know but it was good i was overdressed of course because i don't like to be cold and um other than that we had a great great time and i picked this hat up that i'm loving Cannot wait to hat day. Cannot wait until hat day. My babies are gonna love this. So today I'm just dressed, you know, regularly, comfortably for a Saturday. Just got back from the grocery store because the early bird beats the worm. And I'm about to wrap up my daughter's friend's present. You know, today is her sweet 13. So we have that going on. I'm gonna be doing a little hanging with myself while she's at her party and Jay's at church. He is um, involved in the production, the Christmas play production that will be running a few times. We're gonna try to catch that tomorrow morning. And yeah, that's all we have going on. Nothing planned really. So if that's something you're interested in, you wanna hang with me, then come on. I need somebody to hang with me today because I'm kind of so low. Let's see what we're gonna get into. Here's the birthday stuff we need to put together. Well, I'm not putting it together. She's going to put it together. I'm going to let her explain what she got for her friend. Hey, fam. Good morning. <laughs> um, of course, we got the car. We got the we got the Robux gift. Oh, card. okay. We got we got this bath gift set. It's very nice. Mm -hmm. That's something mommy wants. <laughs> oh, we got what is in there? The headband for when you do your face. Yeah, got the headband. Got the um, massager. Massager. Got the for <laughs> the scrubber. Oh, a pumice stone. Mm -hmm. What a thirteen year old know about that? No, I'm <laughs> we got the bath bomb. Always gotta have a bath bomb. I see we got a purple and cream theme going on. Purple, green, and cream. We got this um body lotion. Mm -hmm. The mm -hmm. winter berry wonder from Bath and Body. Okay. I see what you're doing here. I see what you're doing. We got the Tree Hut body scrub. If you know, you know. Okay. Tree Hut. Woo. <laughs> we got this um, face serum. Yeah. Because the birthday girl requested this face serum on her list, right? Mm -hmm. So this was the inspiration here. And it says youth on it. Face serum. All right. Again, for a 13 year old. All right. What else we got going? We got the lip balms. We got the jade facial roller. Oh, I need this too. It's where you like put it in a freezer and, and then you get the inflammation down off of your skin. Okay, that's real cute. Face mask. Okay, that's always good. And then and we got, and lastly, we got the facial hydrator. Okay, with rose oil and shea. Okay, so somebody's gonna be doing some teenage facial routines, like keeping it going. You all know about that. And unfortunately, we wanted to put everything in here, but this is too big to go in it. Wrapping paper over here, our green, the purple, the pink. We're gonna hook it on up. And I don't know, I did not wanna use this bag. I don't wanna open this up, so the bag it is, we'll hook it up just chilling right now we finished getting the gift together and now we're just wasting time before it's time to get ready before it's time for her to get ready and while we were wasting time i decided to put on some press-ons you all know a few months back this hair is just herring i gotta do something with it style it or something a few months back we um picked up a bunch a bunch maybe 10 boxes of the kiss brand the press on nails they were on clearance one of our walmarts they're doing a remodel so everything has been clearancing down and i picked up the box of press on nails 
for 50 cents a piece. So I decided to put on some press on nails. I put on some about a month ago in the blog. They did pretty good. They actually lasted almost two weeks. I've been watching TikTok, the best methods to apply press on nails. And most of the methods show you actually like buffering and shaving down the natural nail, which I don't want to do. I don't want to cause any trauma to my nails. The nail place have done enough in the past and I just don't want to do that option. I'm figuring if I'm going somewhere, if I'm in the mood for them, then I'll just press them on. I take the little alcohol wipe that comes inside of the packet and I, I wash my hands. I clean the nails down really well with the alcohol wipe and I just start applying the nails. I don't shape my nails afterwards or anything. I don't do the cuticles, none of that. And to me, I think they look good. So I'm about to show you all. I think they look pretty good. Especially if you just want a little pop. And for 50 cents, and this is that Kiss brand nail. You know, those nails, that brand is pretty pricey in the stores, the nail store, and on Amazon. So for 50 cents, I don't know what in the world I was thinking. I wasn't even into press on nails at the time. Like, I knew about them, but I wasn't into it. I should have just bought them all. I could have been gifting them doing whatever with y'all know we like affordable we're like frugal i'm watching my girl christy daniel in the background just want to congratulate her on reaching her 1k if you haven't go on over to her channel check it out if you like what you see go ahead and subscribe but i've been catching up on your vlogmases enjoying them loving them they've been really fun really really fun hey family happy vlogmas day 10 good morning well good it's almost noon. We are putting a spaghetti bake into the oven. We're gonna finish baking this off. We had leftover Mexican cheese. The thicker sliced cheese is sharp cheddar. Put a little parsley on it. Ground turkey. We got our spaghetti noodles, our spaghetti sauce. It's gonna be right on time for game day Sunday with some garlic bread. Thinking about making some wings too because chicken and spaghetti is popping, right? We have to, in the meantime, run out because 12 days of Christmas in our household is about to start. And these are little gifts that are between $1 and $5. They get to open up a gift every day beginning on the, on the 13th for um, 12 days of Christmas countdown. I think we're going to hit up Dollar Tree because a lot of his favorites are in there. These are the little gifts that build up to the big day. As soon as we get this out the oven and it cools off, we're leaving. The spaghetti bake is done. I tend to slack on my waters, especially on the weekends. So, I need to get my water up. <laughs> 32 ounce, I believe, 32 ounce Stanley. And believe it or not, I actually drink my water out of this cup better than I do the water container or any other cup. So, something we're gonna conquer today. How do I like the cup so far? It's been two months and I do like the cup. So cute, chic, it's not too heavy. Now the reviews were saying this cup was very heavy. I mean, it has some weight on it, but it's appropriate for the amount of liquid that it holds. The handle is very stable and sturdy, very convenient. I love the colors, you know, the gray neutral. And um, the straw, I like. I did not know that in order to sip it, you have to remove your straw and then twist it. I don't know if you all knew that, but one of my students, one of my fifth graders, I'm trying to do it one hand. One of my fifth graders told me about it. Come on, let's close. I'm one handed, y'all. The only bad thing I would say about this cup here is this never lines up. If you know a way to get this to line up, 
every time you open and close it, let me know. That's the only thing I don't like about it. People say these cups leak at the seal. I have not had that problem. I would say just don't fill it all the way up. I mean, it's cool, but you can definitely do good with another brand, Yeti or something like that. It's, it's cute, it's cool. You could definitely do well with another brand. This is not the it, it brand. It does keep my it does keep my beverages really cold for hours and hours at a time. If that's something you're into, the only other kind I heard about this was not to add a hot drink in here. Even though it'll keep it hot, this absorbs the odor from your hot drinks that you can't get out. So I haven't put anything hot in here. Probably won't. I just sip on this all day. Other than that, it's a cool cup. I did get this on sale. You know, I'm never gonna pay full price for an item like this, not a cup. If you have one, let me know how you like it so far. But that's that on this Stanley Cup follow. Family, we have our 12 days of Christmas ready to rock and roll, okay? Couple more days. This is our gingerbread house, which we may do that today or sometime this week but i'm done with my 12 days of christmas for them i just hope they're done with mine we'll see you in the next vlog hit the like button comment subscribe share we appreciate you for being here until next time be blessed be safe enjoy the rest of your sunday bye